Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know that it has been a minute. Today's video is going to be a how I use Laura Mercier's new translucent loose glow powder, their new glow brush, and their set up set down technique. I was actually invited to the launch party for this product and it was so crazy cool. Mario was there, he did a live tutorial demonstration and I learned a few tips and tricks and I'm gonna be sharing one with you that I thought is the most unique that I have not personally seen before and I'm gonna be trying today. Um, he actually warmed up the powder in the palm of his hand before he applied it to the face, which I thought was very interesting. So I'm gonna be doing that today. So if you guys are curious to see me create this look using tons of Laura Mercier products, then go ahead and keep on watching. And I apologize for my voice being super hoarse. I lost it in the beginning of summer and I have yet to find it. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to do is quickly conceal with a little bit of my Laura Mercier Flawless Ultra Longwear Concealer in the shade 3W. I'm just going to take a little bit of that to highlight underneath the eyes and down the bridge of my nose. To blend that out, I'm going to be using this brush by Luxie. This is the 512 Small Contour. All right, so now that we have foundation, concealer, cream, bronzer, and brows on, we're gonna go ahead and start off with the set up, set down technique. So this is what the PR box look like. You open it up and it plays a little video. Hey guys, Mario here. I'm so excited to show you guys this new setting powder by Laura Mercier. So right here at the bottom, we have the original translucent loose setting powder with the velour puff, and then the new translucent loose setting powder glow with the glow powder brush. So the first step I'm gonna do is the set down, and then I'm gonna do set up. So I'm just gonna take a little bit of my translucent setting powder into the lid. I'm gonna take my velour puff, I'm gonna dip in here. And then during his live demonstration at the launch event, he actually warmed up the powder in his hand first before he started to press the powder into the skin, which I thought was very interesting. Okay, so I just quickly set down the areas of my face that I know get extra oily, which is pretty much my whole T-zone over here, including my nose, the center of my forehead, um, my chin, and I set with the matte powder underneath my eyes. And then what I'll do is I'm gonna go in with the new brush and the glow powder, and I'm gonna go over the areas that I wanna glow, but that I set with the matte powder first. So I'm just gonna take a little bit of the glow powder now, into its lid. I'm gonna take a little bit on the brush, I'm gonna tap off the excess, and then I'm gonna start to lightly just dust this all over the face. So in my opinion, I feel like this brush is just a little bit dense to do this with. Um, I accidentally picked up too much powder over here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this brush by Laura Mercier, this is the finishing brush, it's a stippling brush, and I'm just gonna quickly go over the face with nothing on it and kind of like buff and blend it out. I do really like the luminosity that this powder has given my skin though. So next up, I'm gonna quickly bronze my skin. This is the matte bronzing powder in Soleil One, also by Laura Mercier. And then they have this bronzer brush right here, which I'm really liking to bronze up the skin. I'm just loading up a little bit of powder on the brush and then very lightly just hitting into my contours. Okay, so next up for blush, I have this one right here. This is the shade Peach, also by Laura Mercier, and I'm gonna be using their blush brush. And then for highlighter today, I'm gonna to be using this one by Dose of Colors and Desi times Katie. This is in the shade Mirame. So next up, I'm gonna add a little bit of gloss. This one is in the shade Bare Blush. I've been loving it recently. It's not too sticky and it's such a pretty color. And as a last step, I'm just quickly gonna add some SPF because I am going outside today. This one I think is genius. It's by Kate Somerville. It is the Makeup Setting Spray SPF 50 Soft Focus Makeup Setting Spray with, yeah, basically you can just spray this on top of your makeup and it doesn't make it oily. It actually mattifies it a little bit and it's cool because you can touch up your SPF throughout the day. So I'm just gonna do a quick spray of this. And you're ready to go. 
So that is it for this tutorial. I hope that you guys enjoyed watching me use the new set up, set down technique and Laura Mercier's new powders and explore some new Laura Mercier products as well. Most of those were new to me or I've been using them for the past couple of days and I'm loving them. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.